Hi, welcome to Papa's Workshop. When you get the Fox Alien CNC machine, typically it comes with an eighth inch collet and the spindle. And nobody tells you how to change these out. Now in the Fox Alien store, you do have the opportunity to buy a whole set and they're in the millimeters. But in the US, most people will use the eighth inch or the quarter inch. So where do you get the quarter inch collets and how do you change that collet that's an eighth inch in your spindle to the quarter inch. Well, I'm gonna show you how to do it today. <laughs> Let's get started. Come spend the day with Pawpaw and Pawpaw's Workshop. To support my channel, please go to patreon.com slash Pawpaw's Workshop. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how to change the collet from one size to another. Super easy to do. When you get the spindle from the Fox Alien CNC, the collet in here actually is labeled for an eighth of an inch. And I don't know if you're gonna be able to see that in the camera, but nobody ever talks about how to change that collet to something larger. Now again, in the Fox Alien store, you have the opportunity to buy a whole set of the collets. And those are actually in millimeters. So for the folks in the US that use a quarter inch shank on their bits, that will not work. So I have a link in the description below that's going to give you the link to the collets so that you can put this quarter inch in and it will work on the spindle perfectly. But then the question is, how do you get this out? This has a ring inside of here that holds this in place. So I'm going to take off this nut and you can see that this moves fairly freely and there is a ring right down inside of here that actually holds this collet in place. And the easiest, simplest way to be able to get this collet out, what I need you to do is go find a screw, just a simple screw that's long enough that you can actually grab hold to and hold on to it, and it needs to have the flat head. And as far as the diameter, it needs to be able to fit right down into that opening as close to the size of that opening as you can get. And then from there, it's just a matter of pushing it out and it pops right out. And then you can take your other collet and just slip it in, push it in position, and that's it. So that's just how easy it is. I'm taking this eighth inch collet, pushing it out, then I'll take this quarter inch collet and slip it into position. And all I have to do is just push it in. It's just that easy. But again, nobody ever talks about it and I don't know why. So now you know how to change out the collets and switch from your eighth inch bit to the quarter inch uh, bits that you can put in. Or if you buy the call it set from the Fox Alien store or another source, you know how to swap them out. I'm going to show you one more time up close. Just take your screw, put it right on top, and then you'll stick it in, push down at an angle, and it just pops right out. You can still see that ring right down inside. And it's not hurt at all. It's right there. So you can see the ring inside of there on how that is held in place. Then to put it back in or any collet that you have, you can just slip it in and push it in place. And you'll hear it snap in, in position. And you're ready to go. Now, once you change out the collet, I keep this screw now in my little toolbox. That way, anytime I need it, it's right there and I don't have to go hunt for another one. Having the ability to change out these collets and use the quarter inch shank with the V bits or other bits that you may have is a great opportunity. Now, with this information now, you can also purchase a wide variety of different bits in the various millimeters. So you're not limited just to an eighth inch or quarter inch shank. And that really opens up the world on all types of different bits. 
Now, if you like the video today, please go ahead and hit that little subscribe button down below. And don't forget to hit the little bell notification. Because in the next video, we're going to go ahead and take the V-Bits and we're going to start carving something on the basic edition of the Fox Alien. And that's going to be a lot of fun. Again, not too many people are using the quarter inch bits or V-Bits on the basic edition of the Fox Alien machine. <laughs> so that's going to be fun. So don't forget, hit that subscribe button and the little bell notification next to it. Until next time, I look forward to seeing each and every one of you in the next project that I'm doing.